I'm Lori Collins. I'm from the National Wildlife Federation. Um, this is what I normally do. It's print. It doesn't do anything interactive whatsoever, but it's kind of popular. So we, we decided to dabble in print, and I'm hoping I get slightly more than five minutes because Warren specifically asked me to demo two things. Um, so I couldn't get any money, so I scrolled money away out of my budget and made this little app. We saw some really nice shape recognition apps last night. Um, this was kind of our silly little version to see what would happen and how hard it was to make an app. The uh, skunk is a character that's in our mind. So. <laughs> Why do you have to eat a crab? <laughs> 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 what did you eat today, Kat? So you have to guess what Snakey ate. Did you eat the crab? <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> you ate the crab. <laughs> Yay! Snakey's all better. So the skunk's happy because he helped his friends. So then we decided to, to put a real investment into it and try and do something a little more substantial to see if that would give us any more play in the market. I partnered with Moonbot Studios and we made Ranger Junior App Ventures. And this is supposed to be the first of many. some shade. Tap him again, you get the whole thing. Follow his tracks. Lions are big cats. In fact, of all the wild cats, only tigers are bigger. So, and you see these signposts, there's video embedded here. I'm not going to spend my limited time left showing you that. But big cats is these infographics we've made that are scattered for us. So you see how the tiger pair, we relate that to a kid. We have jaguars, leopards, house cats. Um, so, so the explorer goes on for about 12 pages, and there's various things embedded in that. Um, we also have um, a play section, which is, and all the games are in the story, but you can also get them to the play section. We have a jigsaw puzzle, we've all seen digital jigsaw puzzle, I won't do that. We have photo safari, we have the cat, the lions, and the pride. That's the water buffalo. Hmm. Truck and I guess wrong. 
I can replay the sound. It must be hold our breath and the water for up to six minutes. And when I get the right answer, I get a fact. A few different facts. So we'll go back from that. Um, uh, what's wrong with this picture? Sort of a what's wrong? hidden picture kind of thing. Where you have to find the things that don't belong. In the grassland. Tap the things that don't belong. Start with me. Well, you wouldn't see a raccoon in the grasslands of Africa, so that's where you start. But you wouldn't see the rocket ship. And it's all timed, so when you find them all, I still need one more to find the books. Um, you get a thing, so you can, re you can better your score, things like that. Um, we also wanted uh, opportunities for... Don't laugh when I'm doing this, I completely stuck my mind. Somebody close Hello. Let me show one more thing. thing. All right. Okay. So we also have opportunities for open-ended play, not just games. So we have this create section. Um, the sticker board is kind of like color forms, where you have a scene and you can put the animals and you can do whatever you want to them. Um, animal builders. What I'll show. You. Trail Tales is a um, Mad Libs. Animal builders, where you can make your own animal. So you pick your body. My line body can just pick a head, put a cheetah head on that. Hmm. You pick your front legs, you will put zebra legs on them. And your back legs, you give them some ears, we'll put some big old ears on them. Give them a tail. Hmm. And then we have some just wacky stuff because it's kind of fun. So we'll give them some horns and we'll give them a sharp fin. There you go. Can't really see that. So while we're waiting. So anyway, it's the idea for creative play. You can save these and send these off. Um, and there's an animal piano that plays. Rather than piano sounds, you get elephant or lion sounds. And then I'll stop now. That was hovering. That was awesome. Yay. Thank you. Do we have any feedback from people? Think. Silence. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I think it's all fantastic. The only thing I, the only blemish I see is really the loading screen. I'd love to see it hidden. Um, yeah, they, we, we put it in there because it just felt like the loading time, we couldn't get the loading time down. Sure. So, but. That's, that's fine. Yeah. And would you like some lasers? Sure, I'd love some lasers. So lasers on the uh, ready to rip. On the lines. Give them a shot. And that's got to Yeah, I'd say maybe uh, maybe an eight. There's somebody out there. I got to get familiar, re reacquainted with my means and modes. So I'd say we've got a strong eight here. 8.3.7. Um, <laughs> there wasn't 11 there. And uh, somebody had it on 6, or a few on 6. What could be stronger about this app? Make a, make a pure 10. Anyone want to comment on that? Yeah? Um, I think it, it didn't have a lot of energy to me. I don't know. I can't even capture exactly what that means, but I know that my kids are drawn to apps that just have so much energy and excitement and pace. I think that it just it felt so kind of calm and laid back and everything, and I think you know. maybe something threw up. But um, <laughs> talk to talk to Thug because you start with a hyperactive monkey or the alpha the line with like, right at the end. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, maybe add some drama. Drama. Well, it's a surprise. I think it's a surprise that we talked about last night. Okay. Surprise. Right. There are some surprises hidden in there that I didn't. Get a chance to show you, but we tried to do it. But I, I understand exactly what you're saying. I mean, it is, you know, it was meant to. People read our magazine at bed. It's kind of quiet certain times. So that was kind of where we started, and and we probably could have aired by going more in that direction. <laughs>